What's up guys? So today, now that I figured out what was wrong with my sound, I actually had the sound turned off. How nice of me. So, to kind of kick off this video, let's start by um, doing something that has absolutely nothing to do with this video. Oh yeah, if you're wondering, um, I am wearing clothes, it's just the lighting. I'm wearing a pink top. Yeah, because the lighting looks suggestive. It's not what you think. Also, if you're wondering why my background is pitch black, it is because I am actually in the living room. It's actually a perfect background. Anyways, um, let, let, let's listen to what my comment was involving uh, Ch Chadtronic. So, uh, Chadtronic is one of my favorite YouTubers. Do, 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 do. Let, let's go to the part why... I commented on his video in the first place. It, it's not what you think. Oops. It's actually the lamest. Come on. Yeah, here we go. Okay, now that you know what the commercial was, let's look at my comment. I'm going to go on a limb here and say the frog's name is Froggy the Frog. I don't know how true that is. I didn't Google it. That is my answer, and uh, that is my answer. That is what he is called. The end. Take that, Google. I don't need your fancy schmancy stupid research, uh, researchable uh, truth. Uh, by the way, if you guys are wondering why I separated research and then a bowl, technically that is the proper way of saying it because when we fuse researchable together, that is technically, I mean, even though you can make it one word, it was actually research a bowl. You're able to research it. It's a researchable. Okay, just wanted to point that out. So for all of you who's annoyed with the fact that I separated, that's why I did. You're welcome. Anyways, um, researchable truth, uh, truth telling truth. Meh. All misspellings are brought to you by me, the one smart aleck on Chadtronic's comments section. All side effects include annoyance, aggravation, sure anger, and last but not least, aggravation and constipation. This comment you read was only zero dollars plus, uh, whoops. For, for some odd reason, I, d I need to edit this, but for some odd reason, there was a typo there. So actually, one second. Oh wait, no, no, I did that right. But uh, yeah, never mind. Cancel. No, I did that right. Uh, it was only zero uh, dollars plus zero dollars shipping and handling. If you want more details, dial zero 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 dash zero zero zero. I am annoyed at this idiot on the internet. And have a great day. P.S. The ironic part is, I am not a smart aleck, but I am a weirdo who likes to mess with people, and I drink coffee before typing any of this. Are you, uh, you are welcome for this massive waste of time reading this pointless comment. Actually, having very little relevance, like the name of the frog from that cereal commercial. LOL. I'm talking to my YouTubers! Weird. I am weird! Anyways, that, that, that stupid fat. That, that, that is my comment. This is what happens when I drink coffee at night, night, before commenting, commenting. 
But anyways, with that being said, that had nothing to do with the video that I'm actually making. No, no. Today we're going to be talking about this. One second. Not the commercials. Whoops, activate. Okay, I need to go to run flash player. Okay. Oh great, more commercials. I feel I feel blessed. Gotta love those commercials. There we go. There we go. Okay. But let, let's get started. Oh, and then we got oh, Elsa Nail Spa, Elsa's Frozen Real Haircuts. Oh, yes, because this is what we want to do with our lives. Prepare for screams. Elsa's Kissing Jack Frost. Bootleg version. My favorite. Level 1. Are you stop? okay? I'm so confused. Oh no, Olaf caught you. How depressing. You have a new friend suggestion. I mean, I would, but I don't know you, so I'm I don't care. Okay, let's let's try again. This is, uh, oh, um, I, I accidentally exit out of it. Whoops. Spamming. So let's go back to that. Aw, oh, dang it. More commercials. I don't want to deal with this mess, man. Give me a sec. Yeah. Okay. Okay, we're back. We're back. We are back. We are back. Okay, let's. Okay. Okay, back to. Okay, time to do the summer. Summer. I actually don't know if I'm playing this right. Supposed to click on Olaf? It says you're supposed to spam it. This is d oh. This is dumb. You know, it, oh, oh, okay, so let's, uh. Okay, so you guys are probably wondering why this. Well, hmm, I'm not sure about that, but you might enjoy the skill. Sing song. Want to try it? No. Turn off. Stop talking to me, robot. Why? Yeah. Anyways, let, let, let's continue. So anyways, let's talk about my favorite ship, shall we? And yes, I ship these two. Aww. Romance. Ah. 
Um, um, sir, please stop making that face at me. I have problems. That this face is disgusting, and I wanted to stop. But anyways, I'll let the the, 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 the the cult doesn't bother me anyways. Like, get away from me. Ugh. Anyways, yeah. You get it. I mean, it's definitely a cute ship. I actually do ship this. This is some weird thing. I, I like fan fictions. Yeah, that's dumb, though. I like the part where he spins her around and then... Yeah, that this is what I wait for. You two should kiss! Okay, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> wait, wait. Moon. Yep, th th that's my, that's, yeah. By the way, this was made by, um, Imu, Imurichu. I don't know if I'm saying her, right, her, her name right, but she is one of my favorite YouTubers. She is a story time YouTuber. Let's take a closer look at her channel. Might as well, since we are looking at her video. Gotta give rights where rights are due. <clears throat> She is, what I like about her is, first of all, she is a cool person. She does great story time videos, and honestly, she kind of looks like me with her animation videos. I'm like, you're how I want to animate. I suck. But it still looks cool. Even her, even the way she draws her character is kind of similar to mine. Hold on. Well, let's take a look at my picture, shall we? At the one second. One second, just gonna let this load. Just gonna let this load, cause it's gonna load. Yeah, 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 the loading screen is taking eternity. And I don't know why I'm singing like an idiot. <sighs> You smell that, guys. That's eternal waiting. Oh, hey, it loaded. Oh, oh, there it is. Okay. Okay, now a little bit. Now it's just uh. As you can see, my hair color is definitely lighter animation wise in fact my hair is closer to her hair than my actual character that i choose but if you look at her lower pictures sometimes her hair can be lighter sometimes it can be darker i'm actually just lazy with my animation hold on see if i can find any more pictures Like I said, I'm lazy. Yeah, let's see if I can find... Oh, here we go. Oh, sorry you guys had to see that. We'll just... Yeah, I'm single now, so it's kind of awkward. Anyways, let's continue. So we got this. Nutshell. Nutshell. I love Nutshell. He's awesome. Still can't believe he commented in one of my videos talking about he knew me. Funny thing is, he did look oddly familiar. That. Oh yeah, here we go. More, more of me versus... Okay, as you can see, I, I have definitely a different style, but it's still similar. Oh yeah. Wait, wait, I, I love this recent picture I made. I'm definitely going to do some more Minecraft videos. If you guys want to see more of that, please let me know. Oh, yeah! 
I'm weird. Q and A. Well, eating a sandwich. I've always loved eating sandwiches. I never thought that eating a sandwich would be so cool. <laughs> Anyways, yep. I don't know what's with me what's wearing pink and red, because obviously pink and red does not match, but whatever. Um, yeah, so her name is Emu Rich. Let, let, let's take a look. Let's, let's click on one of her videos. She has a ton of subs. Um, let's go with this one. That is a pretty big elf head, but to be fair, if you took away the big eyebrows and just made them thinner, it would look exactly like a slug, just a bigger th forehead. Just to shriek his head a little. Wait, no. Look, they look exactly the same. He just has a slightly bigger head. I mean... Yeah, we all have different heads. Look at my forehead. I got a big old forehead. I'm a girl. Just saying. Also, <laughs> you know who my crush is. Hey, if we're going with anime crushes, I might as well go into this. You guys are going to be weirded out. Hold on. Vegeta. Spelt wrong. Nah, hold on. I do know how to spell it. That's not it. <laughs> I'm missing the E. I'm having one of those days. There we go, Vegeta. D B C. Hopefully, we don't get into any weird pictures. I just want to. I want to show you why I think he's hot. Hold on. Forget the actual wood. Fan art. You're about to see why I find him hot. Um, deep, deep, deep. Um, maybe not. Maybe I gotta be more specific. Vegeta. And Bulma. Okay, we're good. Okay, you're about to see why I think he's hot. Okay, um... Let's start off with the fact that he is a good father in the fan art for some reason. Yeah, he's like a really great dad. And he's not as mean. He's still serious, but he's not a bad guy. 
Just something I like. He's actually more of a dad figure. He's famous. I'm sorry, but look at that Treg's picture. He's happy to be with his mom. His dad's happy to be with his daughter. It's just adorable. Don't know why they're old. I don't agree with that, but... Honestly, if Trunks were real, I would agree that that's what he'd look like. And Vegeta. And their daughter, Bulma. If you saw the actual Bulma, she would not look like that. <clears throat> but anyways, continuing on. Um, you see more sensitive? Okay, I like sensitive dudes, gay. And Vegeta? He has his moments. Um, let's again get more into depth. Um, look how innocent that is. He's so, there's emotion there. That, that, that's, e. I'm sorry, I'm just telling you guys why I crush on Vegeta. That's dumb. But, and then, then we get pictures like this and you're like, okay, Vegeta, what are you on? <laughs> but I actually like his hot face, just changed his hair to like normal hair and you basically got, you got Vegeta. We got awesome pictures like this. Sarbon, please don't be anywhere in gifts. Yep, th this is beautiful. Okay, this is funny. Myth. Not even once. Before. After. It's true, though. Dragon Ball Z logic, people. Anyways, you go on. Let me see if I can find a really good picture of Vegeta. Get some really interesting fan art. That's ugly. But, I mean, cute at the same time. It's adorable. Hmm. Why am I not finding- I'm getting some really weird fan art. I do apologize, guys. I wasn't trying to be weird. Here we go. This is where the art starts to get a little weirder. Yeah, like I said. <clears throat> he's more of just a shy guy. Um. Let's see if I can find- Oh, and then we get cute pictures of Bulma. I think they're such a cute couple. Look how pretty she is. She's just like, yes. It's so cute. Hopefully we don't get any weird photos because we want to stay clean because I am a child-friendly channel. Um. No. Goku. I didn't need to see that. Why does he look so... I don't know. I think the word is I'm real. Why do they all look like they're from Steven Universe, but at the same time real? I don't even know here. Trunks and Goten hanging out, being best friends, doing best friend stuff. I guess I really don't have any real pictures to kind of get why I would think he was hot. I mean, that one's pretty cute. Well, exclamation is it's more of his personality. Well, there we go. Th there. There. You happy now? That's my reasoning. No, I'm kidding. This is my reasoning. It's so cute. It's so adorable. I like any family friendly. Anyways, enough of my crush. I'm sorry. I went on and on about this Vegeta being my crush. <laughs> no. He's okay. I'm sorry. He's okay, but we all know that the better one, not him, but we all know that this dude is much better. We all know that light is the better one. Hold on. Honestly, I think that picture is great, but my favorite picture of him is actually not when he... Wait, there we go. Innocent. When I see that face of light... That is the light. 
that I like. Yes. I'm sorry. Death Note, episode, episode 60, live reaction. Aw. Yeah, so, I mean, just look, he looks like two different characters. Anyways, point being, I mean, does this dude even look hot now? Eh, he's alright. I've seen cuter. He's not that cute. Uh. Okay, that seems pretty cool. I don't care about furry cat whatever that is but I do like Hello Kitty does that make me a furry because I don't really I mean I think the definition of being a furry is what okay well let's just look at the definition of furry my thoughts on being a furry is basically you cosplaying as a furry and crushing on other furries uh, let, let's go to google for this <clears throat> furries Getting to weird territory. Why is it a creepy whisper? Furry. I. 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 Furry you. Google. What is a furry? Ah, uh, great job. An enthusiast for animal characters with human characteristics, in particular, a person who dresses up in a costume as such, a character or uses as an or uses one as an avatar online. A small fur covered animal, typically a rodent. So technically, no, I would not be a furry. If you are a brony or a My Little Pony fan, you are technically a furry. Because even though they don't have fur, they are a humanoid animal. And technically they do have horse tails and a mane, which I think counts as uh, hair. Anyways, let's continue. Okay, I actually did like The Last Unicorn. You can actually find that free on YouTube. No, they're not the same thing. Please don't be mad at me. Okay, I didn't actually make the video beforehand because uh, it was too long. I deleted it. I did, and Plus, I didn't have no audio on. But, uh, what I said in that video, but unfortunately I didn't post it, but I'm just gonna say it in this one. I think bat- I think blonde guys are alright, but... I'm into brunettes. Really, I don't have too much of a type, but if I have to pick a specific type, 
This dude is not it. Okay. That accent, though. Okay, then. Okay, I'll admit that. I crushed on him too. Tiny crush. I liked his song. Okay. <laughs> Going back to YouTube. We're doing some more weird videos. Hold on. We're going to like. My 14 year old phases. So, as you can see, guys, I'm not technically a furry, <laughs> but he is a cat in the anime. So, I don't know, does that make me a furry? He's the one cat-like character I ever crushed on. Unless if I can think of another. <clears throat> hmm. Not that I can recall. He's pretty much the only. But, uh, like I said, I'm not a furry... I just, I just really think that he's cute as a character. I always had a thing for guys with, uh, that. I guess the term is confidence slash shy slash power? Yeah, I guess I'm one of those people. I'm not necessarily into, okay, I'm into strong guys. I'm into strong guys who are sweet, sensitive, but yet confident. I like a dude who's all around. That guy is kind of one-sided, so, uh, like I said, it was a small crush. It wasn't like, oh yeah, that, I was like, yeah, that guy's hot, but that's about it. Let's continue. I don't know how I ended up here, but I'm okay with this. Agreed. I would actually agree with that. I didn't really see the anime. I just saw like, I think one or two episodes. Maybe more? But it, it's very vague to me. But basically what the premise is of the anime is basically, you know, like Zodiac animals? From my understanding, that's what it basically is. And they turn into like these different animals. Anyways, the anime is, eh, to me, I've seen better. Dragon Ball is my favorite. But, yeah, I would go for the more sensible, good-looking, sweet guy, rather than the good-looking, hot, dumb guy. I mean, you think about it. Do you rather a dude who would probably beat up somebody next to you just because they, uh, asked for some money, or be with the dude who, the guy asked the same question to him, but he didn't beat him up? Okay. Call me strange. 
I am <laughs> I am I am the one who does I've okay as a child I thought he was like a best friend figure but as I got older I kind of thought yeah he's kind of cute just a little hold on Steve clues <clears throat> I'm pretty sure I have mentioned um hold on it, he looked he was even more so my type when you see his younger look hold on so this was Steve kind of looks like the cool dude slash nice dude right seemed like a pretty nice dude right let's look at younger Steve I saw like a pretty edgy Steve like picture that was like yeah this is totally oh yeah by the way this is him now kind of looks like a teacher of mine <laughs> not quite my type anymore but he's still a nice dude so yeah but uh point being uh, let's see if we could find the edgy teen photo if I need to type teen teen I can't spell, I know. See if I can find it. Mm. Yeah, because I remember a particular picture. Is you from Blue Clues? Oh, no. Yeah, I said no. Why can't I find the picture? Anyways, this is the closest we're probably gonna get, but there was a younger picture of him where, like, he- See, the problem was with, with his character, though. Um, hold on. Mmm. Odd. I really can't find that one photo that person had showed. Why can't I find it? He, he It was such a good picture. He looked like a completely different person. Oh, wait, hold on. Steve from Blue's Clues. Younger. With. Long. Hair. Don't know if that helps. Yeah, because he went through an edgy phase. He, he used to have a skateboard and everything. Let's see, is this... Mm, he looked closer to that. And then they asked him to get a haircut, and he looked like that afterwards. I'm like, they took away his attractiveness just to make him look... I mean, he was still attractive, but they took that away just to make him look more kid-friendly. Okay, that's just adorable. If that was my child, I would be like, aw, he's such a little genius. His friend, who I forget his name, who has less relevance to me than this guy, is still a cool dude. I liked the other guy better. This guy will always be my favorite. Yeah, but the problem with being Steve on Blue's Clues was eventually it started to get to him. Um, he started to believe... See, because his, na his actual name was Steve. And they gave his character's name, Steve. So he, and since he did the show every single day, he started to really believe that he was the Steve from the show. And it started to really confuse him. So he eventually quit, and he got replaced with this guy. Well, I forget his name for some reason. I guess he just, uh, with this guy, I guess he just wasn't as relevant to me. Nah, they look kind of... Yeah, there was something about this guy that was just better to me. But it, maybe it was because he was really, really genuine and things like that. But I mean, this guy was probably genuine too, but... Eh. Let's talk about the new guy, though. I mean, it makes sense color-wise, 
How are you going to go from this to this? How are you going to change a shirt like that? You can't just change the shirt on people. Well, look, it was even, it even had like little flaps. This is just a v neck. Why? Anyway, you know, sorry you guys had to see that. Oh. <laughs> okay, you gotta admit that's funny. Yeah, that's basically how I mean. You think about it. Night. He's a nice guy. He seems like a father figure. He's an adult. He has brown hair, and he's open with little kids. That's sweet. Well, and he was very genuine about it. He even said on the sidelines, like when he wasn't filming, that he really wanted to be best friends with children, that he didn't want to let them down. But that is exactly why he quit, because he felt he was the character. And if he didn't do as his character did, then he wasn't doing any justice to children. Now tell me that isn't the nice guy. But it is pretty funny and weird to see this. Also, I gotta appreciate that background. I've used that background before. Okay, okay. <laughs> An artist? Hold it. Gotta bring out my handy dandy phone book. D just hear me out, guys. <laughs> I, I can be an artist too, guys. Watch me, watch me art. Well, in a way, let's dim my, uh, my lighting a little bit. Let's watch me art. Wait, I need. Okay, let's let's okay, I need a little bit of an eraser because I messed up a little bit. Oh wait, oh wait. And perfect. Well, and we needed to look more realistic. We, we need more realism to it. Mm, hold on one sec. Um, just gonna add. Do 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 be do be do be do. Yeah, it seems real enough. Hey, kids, look at my handy dandy notebook. <laughs> I could be the next Blue's Clues person <laughs> with my Mario hat. Okay. Mail. I also have, I'm pretty sure I already mentioned this, and let's face it, him as well, but um, if I had to choose host club, host club, so let's take a look at that real quick, shall we? I had to use a crush from this group of people. Hold on, let's get a better picture. Yeah, this group of people. First of all, um, hold on. Why is it not bright? Um, hold on, let's go with this one. Okay, first of all, this is pedophilia right here. I'm sorry, I would not choose this character. He's, okay, first of all, all these people are younger than me. But let's pretend for a second that they were adults, or that I, <laughs> I'm technically 22, so I should not crush on any of these. But hey, they're just anime characters. But technically, 
if I had to choose a crush? It would be him. Be, it would be Tomiki. Unless if that's Tomiki and this is, uh... Well, l let me check out his name real quick. Th this is sad. I watched the entirety of the show and I don't remember any of their names. Um... Honey, Kyoa, Haiku. Ah, here we go. His name is Hit Italia. Hit I don't know how to. Oh, whoops! I don't know how to say his name. I am positive I am saying that wrong. Anyways, yeah, he's the dude that I crush on because he's cute, he's adorable, and again, he's another sensitive guy. There's something about sensitive guys that I just really seem to like. I don't necessarily always agree with some of the- okay, hold on. I don't necessarily agree with his stupidity, but yeah. Do you believe in love at first sight? I don't know, it's kind of me, but it, I could be wrong, but he looks different to me. Yeah, this brown haired dude looks cute. This is just her, that's weird. Oh. Yeah, I like the dude. Blind guy. Anyways, back to, back to, yeah. I prefer kind of darkish, kind of light hair. Kind of like, kind of like mine in between. Okay, I like L. He is high. Okay. <laughs> There's something wrong with me. It, like, that face she's making. Yeah, I think he's hot, too. I like quirky and weird, too. I'm quirky and weird, so obviously that would be my type. I like guys who have stuff in common with me. So, yeah. L, you hot. Um, he does bathe, I'm sure. Nicholas. He's... Nicholas Cage? I forget what he looks like. Hold on. Give me a second, guys. I'm googling Nicholas Cage. Whoops. Nicholas Cage. Oh! <laughs> um... I don't know that I find this attractive. <laughs> I do his face though. So. We could be related. Um, no. <laughs> Okay, but in all seriousness, um, I think maybe in his younger, day, younger days he might have. Let, let's give him the benefit of a doubt. Let's look at some of his, his younger stuff. Eh, nah. Nah. Eh. 
I can't find this attractive. He's more like funny than he is attractive. No, not that it's okay. This is this is attractive though. This is hot. Oh yeah. Wait, wait, wait. Is he the one guy who plays Nicholas Cage? Does he play? Hmm. Is that him? Oh my goodness, that's him. Okay, guys, with long hair again. Eh. Mm, not even with long hair. Okay, in this photo, he's pretty cool. But it's not really cute, though. It's just like, yep. I would see him more as, like, a dad than I would. But maybe it's just because he's older. Like, if he was younger looking. Oh, maybe I should type in younger. Let's look at young. Okay. Young Nicholas Cage is pretty cute. Ew. <laughs> it's just so hairy. I find that complete. Oh, no. Oh, I don't want to save that to Pinterest. Whoops. People are going to question me. <laughs> Okay, so we know about Nicolas Cage now. Um, my laptop's gonna die, guys. So, um, so I'm just gonna edit. Wait, what? Ew. See, the problem is, though, oh, that one's an actual dude, but most of the original Peter Pans, which kind of rent live-action Peter Pan movies, except for, like, the newer ones where they're actually dudes, most of the older ones are females. Ew. I'm like, mm, I crushed on Peter Pan. Technically, I crushed on the animated one. Hold it. Hold it. You guys need to see this. Better not type it adults. That would probably fail. <laughs> Hold it. I don't care what anybody says. See the similarities? Even though he has nothing to do with the link. Elf looking ears, green hat. You can kind of see why girls probably crushed on him. And I'm, and this is probably more like how I saw Captain Hook as a child, even though he looked pretty ugly in the norm. He, to me, I actually crushed on him. Also, can I just see how adorable Tinkerbell looks in this? I'm sorry, but yeah, I, I think she's pretty as an anime girl. And, um,. Um, let's see. Again, kind of weird, but, like, let's see if I could find a good, actually good picture of Peter Pan of what he would probably look like now. Hmm. Okay. This is probably one of those times where I'd be like, if, he, if this was an adult. Actually, if you look at Fakir from, like, what's it called? From, like, I'm trying to think of it. Okay. This, this one, even though this looks nothing like Beer Pan, yeah. I would totally crush on this. Um, okay, this blind guy is actually pretty cute. Like I said, it take, for blind guys, it, it has to be a particular look. This dude's pretty cute. <clears throat> Again, Captain Hook. I would crush on this. Look at how hot he is. Okay, Tiger Lily looks way better um, in this version of Tiger Lily than she did in the actual new Pan movie. I don't know if you guys can remember that. Um, 
Also, dude, the Little Mermaid is both adorable and weird. I would want to see a whole gender bend of that. Um. Okay, hopefully I don't get any weird pictures, but as an adult. I don't want to go any further because I'm scared. <laughs> like, I don't want to get any cough. Okay, yeah, yeah, right here. This I find hot. Adult Peter Pan, guys. You know who he looks like, though? Now that I'm looking at him, I'm sorry, but he looks exactly like. Um, I'm trying to think. One second. Images. He looks exactly like that guy. The prince. Hold on. Just look at that prince. Now uh, let's go to uh, Peter Pan. Yeah. 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 Similarities are very uncanny. Like I said, I'm into brunettes. Also, I am so saving this picture. I'm saving both of these. Why not? Why not? Doobie doobie, just gonna save this picture. Why am I doing this while doing a video? Wait, wait. Save. Anyways, but with that being said, you guys, sorry for my weird crush. Talk thingies. Now you know who I crush on. It ain't Bob the Builder. Hold on, wait. I'm trying to pull this up. Anyways, um, you should check out Emu Richu because uh, she's awesome. If you want to see more videos like her? Check her out. Also, um, she's her anime style is very awesome. She has like a ton of fans. Just hold on. Just look at the wait. Oh wait, wait. Do 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 do. Actually, I don't see. Oh, here we go. Just look at the sub count, man. She is awesome. You should definitely subscribe to her. But anyways, with that being said, I love you guys. Hope you have a great day. And uh, let's just kind of look back on what I looked on today. Oh wait. Going bad. Oh, not it. Okay, and in the words of Patrick, hold on. But yeah. By the way, I do not own SpongeBob. You look at it, SpongeBob. One second. Nickelodeon on Spongebob, but anyways. <laughs> that failed miserably. That! Don't mind me, that will be for another video. But with that being said, Love you guys. Hope you have a great day. And you look at it. Well, wait. You look at it. Yeah. Do 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 do